Hey YouTube, Matt here with Mr. Energy. Hey, today we're going to be using a cutting torch or a blowtorch, whatever you want to call it. We've got some extra steel on the back of this trailer. So this is an old camper trailer that we are cleaning up. We're cutting off excess metal that we don't need. There's a hitch on the back here that it's just a little harder to get to with a grinder or you know reciprocating saw so we are bringing out the big guns i'm suiting up to get the cutting torch the nice thing about a torch is you can get in some really tight spots because all you really need to do is get the tip of the flame into that spot so here we're establishing what's called a neutral flame and I could do another video that shows how to do that, but you basically want to get a nice blue flame and be able to add that extra oxygen, which will blow the melted metal out of the way. Ready for this? So I'm going to climb under here, and you can see you just start on the edge and get it nice and hot so it's red hot almost melting maybe a little puddle of melted metal and that's when you pull that little trigger on the torch to blow the molten steel out of the way so starting on the edge where it's open the metal's going to get nice and hot really quick and doing a vertical I'm just kind of preheating the steel, but you can see starting on the top when you're doing a vertical and just kind of top down, you're kind of letting gravity do some of the work for you. So this is one side and now we want to go to the other side and we're doing the same thing. Blow the air. Just trying to make a nice clean cut. You can see how tight that is to get in there. Probably would have taken a half a dozen sawzall blades to make this cut because this steel is pretty thick. It's an old hitch on the back of this trailer, which we're not going to be hauling anything behind it. So we just don't need it. It's extra weight and we're getting it out of the way. So we're almost through and this probably took maybe 10-15 minutes. My favorite tool, the Sledge-O-Matic, and just pound it out of the way. Nice. Now we're just cleaning it up. A lot of grinding. We probably put two guys, probably three hours of grinding on this trailer. Just getting all the old garbage off and trying to clean it up so that we can paint it. Here's some of the jacks that were in the front. Those came off pretty quick. But hey, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Be safe. Give us a like. Subscribe. I'm out.